Brother Mike, this is your sister Victoria. I was thinking about this. I'm sure you've experienced the same because you're a righteous man who hates injustice, injustice, who hates unrighteousness, and who hates bullies, okay? I've experienced this most of my life. I've spoken up against unrighteousness on jobs, relationships, friendships, and so many other occasions, economics. And generally, when I've spoken up, it's because it's always an oppressor. Even in churches with a pastor, I've spoken up against unrighteousness. And generally, I've found that it's the same thing over and over again. We're speaking up against oppressors. They're oppressors. Anytime you try to beat people down, mistreat people, discourage people, rule and control over people, you're an oppressor. So what I found, I don't know about you, Brother Mike, and that's why I'm, I'm asking you as your sister today, give me some insight on what you've experienced in that. Because I found for myself, many a times, what I have done is spoke up against injustice, injustice against people, and I found myself, when I've done it on jobs, fired. <laughs> I've done it in church, kicked out. So I find this often going on. And what I have found was that when I get through speaking up, I'm no longer a part of that situation or those people on that job. But yet, the people, because of me speaking up, have got to experience the fruits of my labor. And they're all rallying around thinking they got a good boss now. <laughs> when they don't even recognize, they're not even recognizing, your boss is only better because I spoke up and spoke up against that injustice and brought it to the foresight, exposed it. Isn't this something? I was just wondering how you feel. But isn't this something when you speak up against unrighteous people, how you may have to get the effect of the situation for speaking up because there's a lot of people feel the same way you do and know that, that whoever that person is that the oppressor is, that they're wrong just like you know they're wrong. Yet, you're the one that suffered the consequences for it. Hallelujah. I finally recognize, brother, I just wanted to get your outlook or, or what or take on that situation but i recognize that's because i'm a child that's chosen by the most high and it is my place to stand up for unrighteousness hallelujah the bible says much is given much is required to whom much is given much is required so i was just wondering what your take was brother on that too because i can honestly say a lot of people are enjoying the fruit of my labor.